Hi everyone, this is Kat and in this video I'm going to show you guys how to remove your nail wraps. Now if you watch the official Jamberry video, this is what it says you're going to need. The first thing is an orange stick, a Jamberry nail wrap and lacquer remover. I'm going to go ahead and post this on a link on the video. I just went ahead and poured some in the bowl to make it easier. And lastly, you're going to need a cotton round. You can use a cotton ball also. The cotton round just holds its form a little bit better, so it makes it easier to remove. So the first thing you want to do is just grab your orange stick, and you're going to break the seal underneath your wrap. Just enough so that the edges lift up just a little bit. Then, once you lift up all the edges, you're going to go ahead and dip your finger in the remover. Now, if you happen to have put the nail wrap on top of a gel nail, you don't want to use the remover because it's going to mess up the gel polish. Instead, you can use a mix of water and lemon or warm coconut oil. Anything warm and citrusy is going to dissolve the adhesive and help you remove your nail wrap. So after about 15 seconds of having your finger inside the remover, you can go ahead and take it out and then you're going to dip the cotton round in the remover and you're going to start by lifting underneath the nail. Now you always want to start and go from side to side. You never want to start at your cuticle or at the tip because you can accidentally end up removing a couple layers of your nail and you don't want to do that. So your nails grow vertically so going side to side just prevents any surface damage from happening. And you're just going to keep working it until the nails is able to come off. So pretty easy, right? So that's one way to do it, but I discovered an even better way. So you're still gonna need the nail wrap and lacquer remover and a brush. I got this brush at Target for a dollar and I like an eyeshadow brush because it's really short and thick, so it's able to hold a lot of the remover. Once you have it on, you dip it, and again, you're gonna go underneath your nail and just go side to side. So this helps it because there's so much remover on your brush that it dissolves all the adhesives and it makes it a little bit easier to just come right off. I don't know if you can see. And you just keep working it and it should come right off. I'm really happy that I did this video because I'm wearing a sparkle Lee nail wrap so you can see that it left like a little bit of the adhesive on there and I've seen it only happen with metallic and sparkle wraps so if you ever see the adhesive just dip your brush a little bit more and it should pop right off so Again, nice and healthy. You can't really touch my nails, but if you look at them, they're super smooth, there's no damage to them, and everything removed really easily. Go and do the same thing with your next nail. Dip the brush in. You're gonna start underneath your nail and just keep working the brush, just side to side. And remember, if some of the adhesive doesn't come out, just dip your brush some more and just keep at it. and it should easily come off. What you never want to do is rip or peel it right at the end because you can accidentally ruin your nail and you'll be really sad. So take your time, do it right. That way you don't have to worry about your nails when it's the next time to do your jammer cure. So we're down to our last finger and See if I can get it so you all can see. And again, just keep going side to side and just enough strength to have them all pop off. And if you ever happen to do a wrap with gel on top, it comes off just as easily. 
so you can still enjoy all the benefits of gel, the strength and durability, and you don't have to worry about your nails getting all messed up. So that's really nice. I wish um, Jamberry came out with some clear nail wraps because sometimes you don't want to waste the cute ones just to put a coat of gel on top. So I would say get something light like Daydream. It blends in really well with your nail and you can use that and pick any gel color you wish. So there, we're all done. All the little wraps can go off to the side. You can go ahead and clean out your brush and you're all ready for your next Jamicure. So I hope this video has been helpful and I will see you guys next time.